guys it's your girl ty and we're back with another video thank you for clicking on this video whether you're new or a returning subscriber but if you're new press that subscribe button because we lit it and today <laughs> i'm not doing it over i know and today we have me yeah today we have my best friend Michaela. period today we're gonna be doing the best friend tag and Let's get into it. <laughs> First question is, how and when did you and your best friend meet? Okay. You so we start? met. Yeah, I'm gonna start. Aren't I starting? If I, if you ask me the question, don't I answer? And then if I ask you the question, don't you answer? Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Okay. So we met two times. Um, we have two first meetings. So the first time we went to the most ratchet middle school in Boston. Um, and I commented on her Hello Kitty shirt. Don't ask me Wait, why. Did you say Boston? Oh, yeah. I mean, they don't know what I mean, it's a city, city. okay. Yeah. I didn't say what school we went to. I just said we went to the ratchetest middle school. We did. But yeah, so that I kind of shut down though. So I met her in sixth grade. Well, didn't really meet her. I commented on her Hello Kitty shirt. I was like, yeah, your shirt's cute. And she thought she was too bougie for me. Mind she said a quick thank you. I had a Hello you. Kitty shirt on. But like, we was in sixth grade. When we was in sixth grade during that time, Hello Kitty was in. Like, was it Hello Kitty? It was it Hello Kitty. It, it was Hello Kitty. <laughs> it was Hello Kitty. We both transferred to another middle school, um, seventh grade year, which our middle school is like a high school and a middle school. So we were in the first, the same class, and she was late the first day, and she ran to like our like little line, and she was so nervous. And I introduced myself. I'm like, Hey, girl, I remember you. You was the first one that I saw, right? Yeah, cause yeah. You, you legit ran, and it's crazy because we were in alphabetical order, and she's like. You're, yeah, she's ahead yeah. of me. So I'm like, you're um, you're right here. Yeah, she's like, you're supposed to be right here. And she's like, oh my god, thank you. <laughs> and yeah, that was the first thing we went. <laughs> and ever since then, we've been inseparable. So we've been friends for what? Honestly, truly, seven years, eight years now. So it's gonna be nine years in September. Yeah. Oh my god, we're almost at a decade. <laughs> Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? Me. Yeah. I'll take it. I'll take it. It is me. We speak. Roommates. It depends though what we're doing. No. Like if we. I depends. purposely make Tajine get ready before me every time we go out. She does. Because she okay. takes forever. And I take a long time too, but she takes forever. She takes eternity. <laughs> what do you admire the most about the other person? <laughs> of course you <laughs> Okay, this is me think. What I admire most about this girl right here, she stays positive, like 24-7. She really tries to stay positive, and I really admire the fact that she's been one of my only friends that stuck with me through everything, and I could literally call her for anything. The thing that I admire the most about you, she has, like, a very big heart, unfortunately. You're more, like, social than me. Like I don't know, like she uh, she makes hate people. she makes friends. <laughs> she makes friends better than me. I hate people with a passion. Oh my god! If I could pick a certain amount of people I could be around twenty four seven and not see the rest, I would do it. I hate people sometimes. Like That's she'd valid. be so nice, too nice, unforgiving, too forgiving. <laughs> Which I am too, but you be like, oh, I don't think she'd be honest with you. What is a weird food that your best friend likes? What's something I weird that I like that nobody else likes? Well, most people don't like. I can think of a couple right now. Something weird that you like? Mm -hmm. That you wouldn't see most people eating? I could give you a hint. It's like, I got it at, you told me about it at the corner store but and ever since. like everything. Oh, you talking about, um, I was gonna say pickles, yes. but it's the spicy pickles yeah. that's cut off. <laughs> some pickles in the bag oh my god it don't gotta I be the small weird, ones though but a lot of people don't eat the pickles in the bag like i could do oh, i yeah, have true. the big like i'm like snooky i could take like a big juicy like spicy pickle in a bag this girl country she eat everything i, eat everything. <laughs> well, I don't even know <laughs> it's a weird it's food funny. oh something that she eats that i don't like is avocado mm -mm. i love me some avocado Avocados with the salt. Oh, if it's not in guacamole, I don't want it. I love avocados any type of way. Mm -hmm. That's what they say. Butter. 
It just tastes like you eating a whole stick of butter. Like, how do people eat avocados? <laughs> it's like butter. <laughs> My lashes are High Sadiddy by House of Reverie. Y'all see it. Money. Who's the better cook? Me. <laughs> <laughs> I could cook, you but cook. she cooks better. <laughs> what is the name of your best friend's first crush? Don't do that. <laughs> you better not even say the name I think you're gonna say because I will push you off the chair. Cause it's not him. First one, like what? First ever like crush that I ever had. Like ah! Yes. first crush I didn't really have crushes and uh, and if it's anything it was celebrity she did not like none of the boys we grew up with bro <laughs> no and if I'm gonna say first crush I would have to say like she's gonna hate me for saying his name but I'll blur it I know it's like trash because they're secrets I'm missing how y'all been doing with this pandemic if your best friend is single which I am <laughs> But the question is, if your best friend is single, mm -hmm. describe their dream partner. All right, so she wants something that's family oriented. That's one. You have to believe in God, that's two. Um, you gotta be tall, that's three. Maybe like athletic build, you know, brown skin. She don't do light skin. She don't do caramel, no nothing. Hey, they gonna call me a colorist. I don't care, <laughs> it's true. She don't do caramel, no. she don't do light skin. She do brown skin and dark no, skin. Because yes. Because length of time, have you, the only, like I've only seen Tajanae to name one light skin person. Yeah, I be seeing, I be seeing light skins. I be like, oh, he's cute, but it's not like. Don't listen to her. Nah, don't listen to her. <laughs> don't listen to her. What else? I like them all, but um, you got. I I'm I'm more attractive. I, yeah, I'm like you even know. without me trying, it'd be around. Exactly. Okay, I was. You gotta be smart. That's when she ain't doing no dummy. You gotta get money, but you don't have to have <laughs> money to be with her. Like she'll take you, but you can't be broke. I'm telling you, if <laughs> you can't be ugly, cause her dad gonna get all your ass. That's my girl's dream guy. And I would like to say she don't want you in the hood or nothing. She wants you like, you know, focused. Yeah, I'm not really like a hood nigga type of girl. They're cute and all, but like for real, for real, no. Your dream guy, it's kinda like mine. But she like hoodies. Oh, <laughs> she loves I hoodies. love hoodies. Love hoodies. So that more of like an athletic build too. Light skin, brown skin. Mm -hmm. You do dark skin mm -hmm. too. Never again. <laughs> but mostly, mostly like light skin, brown. Skin. I'm good off y'all dark skin. Niggas. What else? You gotta be smart. Yeah, I was gonna say same thing as me. All right, let me just go right there. I Are you gonna say he doesn't have to be smart? <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you're trying to tell them? <laughs> because not all the niggas I talk to is like the smartest in the bunch, but you gotta have like some street smart, some type of smart. Hey, stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> what you anyway, if you're not book smart, you need to have street smart. And if you have street smart, you need to have that bag in your pocket. You just gotta be a thorough nigga. You can't be broke. A real. You can't be broke. Bro. Nigga. You can't be broke. I'm gonna keep saying it. You cannot be broke. I don't care if you call me a gold digger. You cannot be broke. I am not taking care of my nigga as soon as I meet you. That's facts, cause that's <laughs> <the> <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> I thought you were gonna come at me for a second the way you looked at me. I was like, what? I'm wrong. You be meeting niggas and they just be wanting you to get those That's stuff. Like, if you don't like down the line, like when we fucking each other and you get broke, you know I su support you. First as of my all, man. But dudes be wanting you to do girlfriend things when you're you don't got that title set, so don't do it. Okay. Yeah. Don't do Period. it. Period. What was your first impression of me? 
My you did the first time. Which one? Like well, Hello no, Kitty. You, you wouldn't do like yours in general. She she first of all she was in the honors class. So the honors people, like I told y'all, you always do. This. Like I told y'all, we went to a ghetto school. So the honors students thought they were better than us. I swear to God, they did. So when I said your Hello Kitty shirt was cute, she did a little uh, thank you, and then ran away with her corny nuh -uh, friends. Like, nuh -uh, nuh -uh. First of all, we all had to sit at a certain table, and it was lunchtime. Wow. And uh, like I really like we weren't like friends, friends like that. She just said she liked my shirt, and I was like, thank you. No, like, no she said she's like thank you, and then you just walked me, away I'm with that nasty school up. lunch. But. <laughs> But the second time we met, I just thought she was really pretty and she seemed nice. She looked really nice. So I was like, why not? And she looked like she had a friend. That's the first thing that came to my mind. I'm like, she needs a friend too. Because I didn't know nobody at that school. Yes, yes. Bro, because I kid you not. I feel like everybody knew somebody. I didn't really have a first impression of you, like the like sixth grade. But like seventh grade, when we like first year, I was like, oh, she's so sweet. Cause I'm I like, thought you were so nice. It was like literally you like clicked. Like mm -hmm. the first time we started. I was say we ate lunch together. It was crazy. People were like, did y'all already know each other? We was like, no. no. <laughs> like I commented on her shirt. That was it. They're like, wow. I'm like, yeah. It's kind of crazy. Then from there, like we just started going on each other. What are my biggest fears? Your biggest fears? I would say not getting the life that you want <laughs> because. You will cry. <laughs> what else? Um, something that you're really scared of. You don't like cats. Oh, you scared of Maisie. <laughs> no, that cat's a devil. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, what else? Bugs. I could deal with bugs, actually. I could deal with bugs. Like, they don't terrify me. Spiders? No, that's you. I could have sworn you scared of spiders. Mm -mm. You miss someone, though. Something that we both scared of. Snakes? Yes. And it is something else I'm really, 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 really afraid of. And it's weird because I have a tattoo. Needles. I hate shots. You should know that. I am terrified of shots. I thought you got over that because you got the tattoo. Bitch, that don't mean shit. I'm still scared. Of it's a, it's no, it's the not. No, thing. it's not. This y'all, she sounds like no. There's a difference between getting your blood drawn and taking a shot, getting a shot, then a tattoo. A tattoo's on the you know, it's just scratching my skin. Baby. But the needle, the needle is in your like dragging into your but skin. But the shot is literally like a poke. No, in his... no, a shot. First of all, the nurses. It depends on the nurse. Every time I get a shot, I have a bad experience where they just juke the damn needle in my arm. So I don't care. I will forever be scared of shots. And just a little background story. I was in born here. So when I first came up here, I had to get my immunizations. I hope I said that right on YouTube. Are you traumatized then? Was that what yes. you were going to say? <laughs> I have a scar like right here. You could. Y'all see it? Every West Indian child got this. And when I first came up here, before I was able to go to school, I had to go get my shots. I had 20 shots to get. You would think as a young child, they would give me a break in between shots. When I tell you the nurse did, they really, they no, did she, back back? she did back to back to back to back to back. And she gave me like a two minute um, break because I was crying so much. Like I was screaming. And <laughs> like you know me. I was dramatic as hell. She was dramatic. And my dad screaming. wanted to punch her and everything because she would not stop y'all. Like lungs. she just kept on boop, boop, boop. That's why it's so damn big. Because some people's is smaller. What's your best friend's dream car? Her dream car is a Jeep. Any Jeep. Preferably, don't you want to, uh, oh, I know this, I know this. You have a certain color you want. Is there, right? Your dream car is a Jeep, bro. Don't tell me you're, I'm wrong, because your dream car is a Jeep. It's not any Jeep, but it's a Jeep. What you mean it's not any Jeep? Because the ones that we need. <laughs> <laughs> they, it doesn't look, like, there's different Jeeps. All right, and but you know I want that, I'm I want that one, that's that one look. You know what one look I'm looking for. The big one with the four doors? Yeah. Exactly. Anyways, we is a Jeep Wrangler. To no, it's not a Wrangler. So what's it called? I forget. <laughs> <laughs> but I take pictures of it all the time. <laughs> I be, no, it's a Jeep, but I be forgetting. I be forgetting the name of it. But it's like every time that I see it on the street, I'm like, yeah, that's it. But I don't. I'm not sure what color I would do. I, I would probably I could be the car. She said she liked the black one and the gray one. I remember you said that because we seen a gray one passing by the street yeah. when we was smoking, and you yeah. was like, what? Yeah. What's my but dream it's car? But it's going to be a Jeep and I'm going to wrap it. Your dream car 
is the I have I have a couple though. Okay, so, let me hear it. Like you should know expensive this. one or like a just a dream car in general, like what? Charger. We talk about chargers all the time. Challenger. Oh, a challenger. Challenger. <laughs> no, I meant challenger, bro. <laughs> I said charger. <laughs> challenger. <laughs> challenger. I swear to God. I What's my challenger. other one though? And your other one is like, a um. A challenger is like a car I'm gonna get when like I first start my career. So yeah, like, but like your time. car, like now, if you can get it, you would get it right now. Is like that Volkswagen. Yeah, but I'm talking about like what's my top top car? I have to get. I told you it's gonna be my mom car. I gotta be my uh, um, G wagon. Yes. Oh, okay. How expensive them G wagons is? I gotta get my G wagon. Preferably Even if I have a G, I'm probably gonna get a G wagon. I want too. a G wagon. Because it's so different. Bad. It's different. It's different. But yeah. Oh, they could. Yeah. That's you thought I didn't know, but I knew. What's your best friend's go to artist? Yours is Lil Baby. Dominique. <laughs> you know, you have my heart. And hers is Boogie. A Boogie, to be exact. If you know me, you just know I love a boogie. She ran into I met y him. I met him. And she, she knows cried. I exist. She cried. I cried, but I didn't cry in front of him. I cried later. <laughs> <laughs> she stood there and just stared at him. And he gonna tell her, give me a hug. I talked to him. I would have ran to his arms. He didn't say that. That's not what he said. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm sorry. Jesus. That's not what he said. He I might said. do a story time on it. Cause we had a moment. We had a moment, and Ella I gonna it. kill you. <laughs> I'm just saying, like I love, I love him. Like, I, mean, I love him as an artist, what not you think? as a. I'm not gonna say as a person, but like you know what I mean. All right, one word to describe your best friend. I'm interested to see what you'll say. Determined. <laughs> Cause I like that one. Thank you. I like that. Thought about it. Mine's for you is loving. Cause you're just like I'm working on that. You're so loving. Don't think I'm gonna be loving forever. But it's not a bad thing. Yes, though. It is. Lately it's, it's not a bad thing. Lately it's been like not really a bad thing, but an eye opener. You niggas don't deserve me. <laughs> like in general, like she's just a lot People don't person. deserve me. They don't though. They don't. Oh, and the last question is what is our favorite memory? Well, what's your favorite memory? You want me to go? Yeah, you could go. All right. <laughs> now, <laughs> my favorite memory of us is when, well, I'm just going to say, I'm going to say this one because it's the first thing that popped into my head. But we was at this party, right? <laughs> it was our freshman year. It was my And control. we was, it was, it was your birthday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, we at this party. The party's about to end. Everybody outside. I remember, yo. Let me just. It was just. It was just mixed. Hold y'all. Let me just tell y'all real was quick outside. about the party because I will forever remember this. It was me, her, and our friend Samaya. Samaya. And then, we was with them, and I just remember that party. We was singing itty bitty piggy to the fullest, y'all. The <laughs> fullest. We were going hard. Hard. And when I tell you he's going so hard, and my crush in from college, my freshman year, was behind me, and he was hyping us up with his friends, y'all. Like, they was showing their money, hyping us up. So we was really in a itty bitty pay, like going hard. I was on the plane with the wang. You can call me Whitley, I go to Hell Lane. Listen, I'm the baddest in the school, the baddest in the game. Excuse me, honey, but nobody's in my lane. Right after that song, it seems like the music just stopped. Because it was like, I feel like there was drama going on inside the party. Like, legitimately, the drama started inside the party. Now you can go. It was about the time, like, it was, like, over, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was over. Everybody was going out. It's mixy outside. Like, literally, <laughs> well, they, I think they were arguing. And, yes. like, people was just, like, you know, standing around, chatting, like, trying to see what's about to go down. Bro, but real quick, if you're going to be a show, nosy. you know what party we're talking about. It was 27, 2018 College 123 Road. That party. It was what? a football team against the DC people, y'all. It was Rose. a football team against the DC people. But yeah, so they I don't know my my like memories blur. But anyway, so we like we da -da 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 -da, playing outside. <laughs> 
Then all of a sudden, no, but you was a big part. They was fighting at first, and we was so mixy. Oh, uh, first of but all, but we didn't see them fighting. For yes, real. we did. First of all, we was they was fighting for real, but we was like away from them fighting. We was watching them argue and stuff. And mind you, we was with Samaya and Day, and those are our like bougie friends. But we was like then, from afar though. Then we our like not our ratchet friends, but our friends that are more mixy was with us too. Tati and them like y'all know oh, yeah. so she told us so she's like come on y'all like let's go see the fight yeah we went closer so we was really we're to going to closer see. to see the fight y'all and all of a sudden all you heard was bop 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 <laughs> we started running <laughs> yo when I tell you we was out we was out you have, you have that video no. hold on I was out. <laughs> I she was gonna be in the She tried to say we, not. Oh, okay. Because this is some part of the memory. I'm done. I'm out. <laughs> you know, I. So I run. I'm out. But I stopped at a certain, you know, a certain point where I wasn't too far, but I was far enough. I look back. I'm like, Michaela. Where's Michaela? Michaela back there. She's running. She's <laughs> She left me out. Let me explain to you what happened in my mindset. She's a So, when they was, like, when the whole thing was going on the fight, I was being mad nosy enough because my, like, little crush or whatever you want to call it, he was over there arguing too. So I'm watching y'all. It's legitimately raining outside. That was one. It was drizzling outside. It was. And when I tell you, my sneakers were muddy after yes. that. I lost the whole hoop earring. When I tell you, it was raining and it was just everybody outside. And then what happened was, y'all, these niggas just started tearing off their shirts, bro. They was just, <laughs> <laughs> it was just turning to the Hulk. It was just tearing off the shirts. So basically, I was by a car the whole time, and somebody had went to their car, and I was staring at them the whole time. The whole thing was going on. So they was arguing. Well, they was with their friends talking about some. Oh, we we need to open the car door. I need to get this. I need to get this. So I'm looking like, what's he about to get? Mind you, she was kind of a little bit far from me, and I didn't have my glasses on. So, that was the part. And I didn't have that no contacts on, no nothing. So then basically, we were all talking, a kiki ki and giggling, and all of a sudden, all I heard was boop, boop, boop. And I had to stop and register what was going on. So the first thing I did is I dropped down by the car. You hear them shots? You don't stop and I, register nothing. I <laughs> dropped. I didn't like really like stop and look, but like I dropped down. The first thing that came to my mind was drop and roll. I don't know why. I thought it was so then I heard them, all my friends yelling for me like, come on, come on. So that's when I started running. But then how, it's crazy because... Half of our other friends were still by the shooting. Talking about yeah, no, they back, were they You have playing. to find a video from that night. I don't even. I honestly. Then Tasha needs the words because she's talking about some blicky got the sticky. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so my and they was so fed up with we this got that video too. <laughs> they <laughs> was so then fed after up with all us. that the cops came. And we waited mad long for a Uber right outside yeah. in the rain. And it was crazy because everybody was like, oh, everybody that had cars was just driving by. Some people was walking <laughs> back to campus, yo. People was really walking back to campus. I and I refused. Walk. I, I was not doing it's that It's really not that far now that I, you know, stayed. But it was raining. It was It was muddy. raining. It was already shooting. And it was just like, it was a bad night. So people was walking by and it was just like, people was driving by. So once at one point, somebody drive by and was like, oh, do y'all need a ride? Like some nigga, you know, he was trying to get some car. So my I was so pissed off that day. She was like, fuck no. Like, she was so rude. And our Uber took like a whole 15 minutes and the bitch gonna say, we should have just took that ride. Like, we you think? We were sitting on a curve. <laughs> sitting on a curve. Um, my favorite memory has to be, well, I honestly was gonna say, the first thing that popped up in my head was our whole high school senior year. Like, that whole summer yes, before we went to college, that was just it but more specifically our prom night and after prom like i feel like that was always a memory that's gonna stick in my head for her and like the rest of our friends because like i don't we know about really, y'all really but our prom, prom was like it was nostalgic we had a really good prom we had a good time and we had a good dj mm -hmm. like it was a point where and like, after the prom we had a party we had a whole party even when i got shut down we still went to a party and then went to the, and went beach. To the beach and got lit 
but like prom was just we went to high school where it's like very unique senior class was like not really divided but like you could tell like we didn't all really mesh with each other but prom night y'all everybody together. was just it was a good time though it prom was, was just it was good. a very good time uh-huh yeah that's but yeah, that was our last question. And yeah, if you would like to see more of her, comment down below. It doesn't really matter if you want to see more of yeah, me. I'm, I'm going to be on the chair anyways. <laughs> I was trying to... <laughs> so stay tuned for that. But if you made it to the end of this video, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. share and subscribe 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 because your girl is trying to get to a certain Whoa. number but yeah thank you for watching <laughs> get off my face